Hello and welcome to the former goods outlet building of Hornby Hobbies here at the Westwood Estate, now home to the One to One Collection. I'm Grant Glees, Chairman of the Trustees of the Heritage Electric Train Trust. I'm here to give you an update on the situation regarding the restoration of the poor subunit 4732, which will be an exhibit here at Margate. 4732 has been here at Margate now for five years. Initially it moved here to storage, but now we have reached agreement with One One Collection that the unit can be restored and become a permanent exhibit here. The first coach to be restored is driving motor brake 12796. This is now designated Car One and the Heritage Electric Trains Trust has launched the Car One project to raise the funds to have this vehicle transported off-site and professionally restored for display here at Margate. The estimated cost of the Car One project is £50,000, which is not an inconsiderable sum of money, but I think you'll agree the restoration of this unit is long overdue and definitely needs to happen. If you look past the flaky paint, the actual structure of the coach is not too bad at all. The paint job was applied in 1982. That's 41 years ago, it means it's older than Prince William. The distinctive trophy maquette is still here from those last years in service. There is evidence of some water ingress and we've had to take some of the wooden panelling down where it deteriorated. So there's work to be done here definitely to bring this coach up to scratch. It's not that straightforward. That's why we estimate about £50,000 is going to be needed on this vehicle. So five years of undercover storage has been kind of us up, giving it a chance to dry out after 20 years open storage at Coventry. But if, like me, you're rather sick of seeing it faded and looking less than its best, then it's time to do something about it. And you may be asking how you can help. Well, there's two ways you can help. One, you can sign up to our 750 supply scheme donation pledge. There will be details of that in the comments section. Or we'll be launching a Just Giving to fundraise towards the £50,000 target for the restoration of this coach. Hopefully you'll be able to support us in one of those two ways. And thank you for